On stage in Nevada, Donald Trump's running mate, J.D. Vance, publicly tells supporters Kamala Harris doesn't stand a chance. We don't want a wacky San Francisco liberal serving as commander in chief. We don't want Kamala Harris. But in private, Vance is much more candid. In an audio recording, he appears to admit to donors Harris is a bigger threat than Joe Biden. All of us were, were hit with a little bit of a political sucker punch. The bad news is that Kamala Harris does not have the same baggage as Joe Biden because whatever we might say, Kamala Harris is a lot younger. Kamala Harris failed, weak, dangerously liberal. With the race suddenly tightening, now both campaigns focusing on battleground states with dueling TV ads. The one thing Kamala Harris has always been, fearless. Harris testing her momentum in the swing state of Georgia in one of her biggest rallies yet, saying she's a former prosecutor who knows Trump's type. So in this campaign, I will proudly put my record against his any day of the week. Kamala Harris unleashed the worst border crisis in American history. Republicans trying hard to shift the conversation away from an interview of Vance from 2021 that's gone viral, calling Harris and others childless cat ladies. We're effectively run in this country via the Democrats, via, via our corporate oligarchs, by a bunch of childless cat ladies who are miserable at their own lives and the choices that they've made, and so they want to make the rest of the country miserable too. But Harris's campaign now claims it unearthed more video of Vance, this one from 2020. You, you go on Twitter and almost always the people who are most deranged and most psychotic are people who don't have kids at home. Okay, so Ashley, this fight is clearly heating up. What's next? Well, Adrian, from dueling ads to rallies, both campaigns are in a race to define Harris to future voters where she's lesser known. Harris is expected to start a tour across battleground states next week with her new running mate. But when asked today if she's chosen someone yet, she said not yet. Mm, interesting. All right, Ashley Burke in Washington.